Oh wait everyone, please ignore the sirens in the background, uh, it's South Africa, if you can hear it. But yeah, welcome back to a new video. Um, I thought of starting this video about a bit different, so I'm gonna do my check-ins now, so I'm gonna take my weight and then like show you guys everything. And then I'm gonna do some posing just for a physique update and then I'm gonna send that to my coach. And maybe I'll pop up still images because the, like... Yeah, uh, you know, it's not the same. But anyway, and then after that, then I'm gonna be, I'm gonna show you guys meal one. My coach changed my diet a little bit. So yeah, I'll check you all for that. I hope you enjoy the physique update. That's how I'm currently looking and my, how, what my weight is and so on and so forth. But yeah, so we're about to have meal one of the day, which is right now, it, like I said, it changed. It's, if this thing can just focus, it's really light, but I'll edit it. Anyway, yeah, so it's um, six egg whites and then also a protein shake, which consists of 15 grams of peanut butter and two servings of 100% whey protein see i'm about to have that my coach changed my meal one from 60 grams of oats the two servings of whey and then the 15 grams of peanut butter but yeah now we have this because he took out the carbs and the reason for that is as you all know by now hopefully i'm um, prepping for my competition and the idea is to lose as much weight or not as much weight as possible but um, get as lean as possible so yeah it's actually crazy how much weight i've lost like this morning I was 78.8 .8, as you guys saw and yeah I started at 70, 70, oh, I mean 85 point something like just at 85 kilos so yeah I've lost like 7 kilos which is quite crazy and we're only at 8 weeks out right now so I really don't know what my weight is going to be yeah so as of today like the video I'm making right now I'm 8 weeks out of doing a drop so I'm probably 7 weeks out so yeah, um, I'm about to finish this and my gym is also closed today, so I have to go to a different gym which is fun, um, so we're going to go film there, we're going to have a huge arm day, so that's pretty cool, so yeah, I'll check you all at the gym. I'm on my way to the gym now, I'm about to train arms, so a bit of um, biceps and triceps today, and yeah, I just want to do a quick review on the new pre-workout that I bought, it's the Heavy Nation Pre, I put it on my story on IG. But yeah, it's a really good pre-workout, um, it's going to review the taste and how they, it's effective and stuff. But yeah, I already drank it so I can um, show you guys how it looks. But it's a pretty cool color, I'll put like a still image on about that. It's like a pretty interesting color, I've never seen something like that. But yeah, it's a really good tasting pre-workout. Um, I've had a few pre-workouts that taste like really bad, but this is definitely my top two for um, best tasting pre-workouts. It's not a, it's not like a sour taste. It's a very well not very sweet, but it's more on the sweet side. It's grape soda, so yeah, it tastes really cool um, and good. But yeah, it tastes a lot like um, 
like a fizzer or what is this look at here? A lollipop yeah. or like a lollipop, um, like a grape lollipop. But I can, if I like, if you don't tell me the flavor and I taste it, then I'll be able to tell that it's grape. So that's really cool. And also the effectiveness, um, I got a really good pump. I started using it two days ago, so I did shoulders with it as well, and I got a really good pump with that. And the overall focus is also really good, like I feel more in the zone when I use it. And my energy levels as well is, um, I can feel like it's up a lot and I'm able to do more in the gym. So that's really cool. So overall, this is probably my top, in my top two for base pre-workouts. Number one still being um, War Machine by Titan Subtrition. That's a really good pre-workout. But yeah, this is definitely um, a close second. So if you guys are looking into getting a pre-workout, then I definitely give this a try. It's a really good pre-workout. So yeah, I'll check you all in the gym. Yeah. I ain't trying to bring you down, but for real, you might as well give up now. Think you got a chance, but I don't see how. Got a real tight grip when I hold that crown. My life been good and bad and all around. The more things I lost, the more I found. One thing I taught myself to do, no matter the problem, refuse to lose. So, how you want it, man? You can choose. If you can't take the heat, don't light the fuse. See, I walk in slow and ignite the room. Like fire, everything I touch, I consume. I'm getting up while y'all just snooze. While you make breakfast, man, I'm on the move. I'm the first one in and the last one out. Whoever owns the place gotta drag me out. I in me, I trust. Yeah, I smell like success. This Elon Musk, huh? Everybody wanna be like us. We don't stop, cause the top just ain't enough, huh? I ain't never gay, no fucks. I ain't scamming. You know black men don't blush, huh? Came here ready to fight on this night. You better just run for your life. Yo, what is up everyone? Just got back from the gym a while ago. Uh, I'm just busy making a meal two for the day, which is 150 grams of rice. And then in here, we have 150 grams of chicken and then also the 15 grams of almonds. So that's not meal two, I, um, it's my post-workout meal for today. But yeah, anyway, I just wanted to address something in this video as well. I know a lot of people ask me if I'm natural or not. Um, or if I've been on stuff in the past, or if I'm on stuff right now for my prep. But no, I'm sc still currently 100% natural, but I won't be forever, because I want to take bodybuilding as far as I possibly can, and um, get my pro card and everything, and actually make a living out of it. I'm not saying you have to be on gear to make a living out of it, but that's just the um, decision that I may I'll make in the future. But no, right now I'm still 100% natural, and I'm not planning on getting in, um, onto gear um, I guess there it's anytime soon, but I will in the future and then also I just want to address like I feel a lot of people that are new to the gym feel like they need to get on like steroids and stuff to actually build a lot of muscle, but that's really not true. So if you are new to the gym, just stay consistent, um, focus on your nutrition and most importantly get yourself a workout plan that you just really enjoy because that'll make everything a lot easier. It doesn't help you go to the gym every day and it's like a struggle to get to like actually do what you have to do, you have to enjoy it. But yeah, with that being said, I just want to address all of that. And yeah, right now we are currently eight weeks out as of today. Um, so I'm really excited for the rest of prep. It's crazy how fast the last four weeks have gone. And the fact that I've actually put on four um, videos now consistently. I'm pretty proud of it because I've never done that. But yeah, I'm, if you don't know already, I put on a video every Saturday. And uh, yeah, at 6 p.m. South African time. So I'm not sure if that in your time zone, but yeah, every Saturday. So if you could please, I'd really appreciate it. if you haven't already, please hit that subscribe button and leave a like. It really helps a lot. The goal is to get to 1,000 subscribers by the 11th of June, which is when my competition is. So yeah, if we could do that, then it would really be awesome because I really want to like make a living out of this. And right now I'm just doing it for fun, so it helps motivate me if you guys leave a like and subscribe and stuff like that but yeah with that being said i really hope you all enjoyed the video and 
I'll see you all in the next one.